today we will learn about phobia phobia is a very common word in our daily life we generally use this word to express fear from any particular object or any situation the word phobia comes from the word phobos which is the name of a roman god we know this kind of word either came from greek mythology or roman mythology phobia defines as an anxiety or mental disorder which is persistent and creates excessive irrational fear of any particular object or situation now we will learn phobia type wise and alphabetically the first one is acrophobia we only need to learn the first portion of this kind of words acro means high places acro is related to high places or heights hence we understand that acrophobia is fear of heights next is aerophobia aerophobia is an irrational fear of fresh air or drafts of air it is also an abnormal or persistent fear of flying next is agoraphobia agoraphobia is fear of pain next is altiphobia altiphobia and acrophobia is kind of similar kind of phobia and we know that alti obviously related to altitude and altitude is height so altiphobia is fear of altitude or fear of heights next is anorexia anorexia is fear of getting fat next is agoraphobia agoraphobia is fear of places or any particular situation that might cause panic helplessness or embarrassment next is androphobia andro means males this term androphobia was originated inside feminist movements to balance the opposite term gynophobia and we know gyne is related to women so gynophobia is fear of women so androphobia is fear of males autophobia it's sometimes also called monophobia it is fear of solitude or being lonely or being alone next is arachnophobia arachnophobia is fear of spider the first portion of this word that is arachno is related to arachnid and arachnid implies spider scorpion etc types of insects next is bathophobia bathophobia is the fear of depths or deep water it is a fear or anxiety associated with the sea or water bodies of various types the term bathophobia originates from greek word bathos which means deep or depth botanophobia we know the term botany zoology and obviously botany related to plants study of plants so it is very evident from this word that botanophobia is fear of plants next is bibliophobia we know the word bibliography uh, there is a list of references at the end of every book which uh, generally called bibliography so the term biblio related to books hence bibliophobia is fear of books next one is cacophobia the word caco is related to ugliness 
or harshness. We know the word cacophony. Cacophony means any bad sound or harsh sound. Caco implies ugliness. So, cacophobia is fear of ugliness. Next is catrophobia. Catrophobia is fear of doctors. Next one is cellophobia. Cellophobia is extreme fear about beauty. Next one is chronophobia. We know the term chronology. The chrono implies the term chrono implies time. So chronophobia is fear of time. Next one is chromophobia and chromo, the portion chromo related to colors. Hence, chromophobia is fear of colors. Next one is cyanophobia. The first part of this word cyano is related to dogs. We know the word cyanology that is study of dogs. We know the term feli. Feli is related to cats, lions, this kind of animals. Similarly, cyano is related to dogs. So, cyanophobia is the fear of dogs. Next one is claustrophobia. This is very common term. Claustrophobia is of being confined to small place. Next one is dipsophobia. The term dipso is also comes from Greek and this term dipso means thirst and dipsophobia is the fear of drinking alcohol. People with this fear will tend to avoid a lot of social gathering where alcohol is consumed. So dipsophobia is fear of thirst and specifically the fear of drinking alcohol. Next one is entomophobia. We maybe know this word entomology. Entomology is study of insects. So this entomo, this part is related to insects. So entomophobia is an irrational fear of insects. Next one is emetophobia. Emetophobia is extreme fear of vomiting. Next one is ergophobia. Ergophobia is fear of work. We can remember ergophobia like that. We know the switches unit of work is arg. And that's how we can memorize that arco is related to work. So arcophobia is fear of work. Next one is gamophobia. We know the words polygamy, monogamy. So, gammy is related to marriage, hence, gamophobia is fear of marriage. Next one is xenophobia. Xenophobia is fear of birth. Next one is xeraphobia. Xeraphobia is fear of old age. You may be heard of this term gerontocracy. The term gerontocracy is the government based on rule by old people. So the term zera is related to old age, hence xeraphobia is fear of old age. Next one is Nociophobia. This is abnormal or irrational fear of knowledge. This term is also known as epistemophobia. Next one is graphophobia, and graphophobia is fear of writing. Next one is gynephobia, which I have already mentioned in the first part of this video. This is fear of woman. Thank you.